Hello friends, good morning. Welcome back to our channel ALP Talks. This is your Lakshmi Bhati. Today I am going to discuss uh, one of the nameplate of uh, inverter duty transformer. Typical nameplate of inverter duty transformer. So this is the nameplate. It, this is a three phase power transformer. Uh, the transformer is uh, as per IS2026. So here you can find KVA and uh, voltages. This is a uh, 5000 KVA and individual uh, we have four LBs. So 4 into 1250 KVA we have different volts. Uh, for HV we have 33 KV. For LV we have 4 300 380 volts. So this is the amps for HV. The amps are 87.5 amp. For LV we have a four number of 1892.2 uh, amps. So this is a 50 hertz, 50 hertz transformer. The vector group is a DY11, Y11, Y11. So four number of uh, star connections are there. The ambient temperature is 50. This is most common in uh, solar power plants. Most of the solar power plants ambient will be 50 and also as per Indian condition also ambient is 50. So temperature rise of oil and winding 50 and 55 degrees centigrade. So the ambient is uh, 50 degrees centigrade. Uh, oil and winding rise are 50, 55. This is as per uh, IS. So no load loss and load loss. This is common trend in uh, solar power transformer 550 kilowatt. Generally 0.1% and 1% is the losses. Some people will say together 1%. In that case, uh, 0.1 and 0.9% will be the no load and load loss contribution. So phases, it, 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 it is three phase transformer, cooling, ONAN cooling. Most 90% transformers will be ONAN. Some people may ask for ONF, that is very rare. Uh, embeddance. Embeddance will be punched on the transfer, punched here after uh, testing. Here the value is a 6.36. So core coil assembly, the weight is 6600, mass of oil 3100 kg, volume of oil 3790. So generally the density of oil will be around 0 0.8 to 815, but per IS uh, 0.89 is the density. This is a 14 ton transformer, winding material is a copper. So we have insulation levels here, as it is 33 kV, we have 170 BIL and 70 PF. Similarly, for LV, we have a 3 kvpf. Generally, for LV, uh, we don't have any BAL requirements. So, manufacturing year, if this is, so serial number, and here last we have a system fault level, 25 kiloam for 3 seconds. Uh, this we have to take care for all the external equipments, uh, bushings and uh, all, bus bars and all. So, yeah, here is the um, uh, template of the transformer. Here you can see, primary side so yeah sorry the primary side will be lv voltage here this is a secondary side uh, 1u 1v 1w this is grid connected so we have four number of lvs here so that's what uh, it indicates now 2u 2v 2w 3u 3v 3w 4u 4v 4w 5v 5v 5w so we have four lvs 1 2 3 4 so we have we have to place a screen, earth shield in solar transformers. That is mainly because whenever we have semiconductor devices, in those cases, we must use a screen between two windings so that whatever disturbances are there from semiconductor side, those are not reflected into the public grid network. So here we used a CT, WTI CT, um, in this case it is on HV side, generally people will prefer to use on HV side so that they can track the uh, units and current how much is generating. So here uh, they are considered taps, almost 9 taps they consider, here uh, we can see tappings, 9 taps, how we have to connect, uh, how it is internally connecting, uh, they mentioned here. So this is the tapping voltage, so we have 36, 300 to 29, 700 volts. Uh, here we have different uh, current values. Uh, so LV voltage that is a fixed value 4 into 380. So 
TAMPS, why they use it is uh, to adjust for voltage variation, they consider the TAMPS. Here is the vector group display. So we can see it is a uh, 30 degree displacement is there as it is a DY11 transformer. So here we can see CT ratio 48 by 3 amp, uh, 7.5 VA class 3. Uh, these things should be properly chosen, then only CT will uh, function properly. So here one caution is there, de-energize transformer before changing the tab. As it is an off-circuit transformer, we should de-energize the transformer and then only we should change the tabs. Otherwise, there is chances for spark and fire also may happen uh, due to arcing. Yes, uh, this is about uh, solar transformer wise, uh, nameplate of solar transformer, inverted duty transformer. Sometimes we can have, uh, here we have 4 LVs, sometimes we can have 2 LVs, sometimes single LV. That's purely based on plant requirement. Yeah. So if you have any questions or comments, please comment in comment section. Yeah. Thank you. Thanks for watching. Stay connected, guys. If you are watching my videos for the first time, please subscribe to my channel. Thank you. Thanks a lot. Bye bye. Thank you.